Welcome back. So let me log in here. I use Koha 21.11 on Ubuntu 20.04 and there I need to open my web browser. I use localhost 8000 for user interface and localhost 8001 for staff interface. So in, in the last episode, we have completed these bootstrap buttons at the left navigation for some important links or links to your website. And, and, and we have completed this bootstrap carousel to represent your library or library images or services at the main user block of Koha Pack and this css slideshow for new arrival at the right navigation so now the most important thing if you might notice this bootstrap carousel and this css slideshow both are 2d so you can have a 3d slideshow at the main user block or right navigation or wherever you want to place on koha pack so here I have a wonderful website for 2D or 3D slideshows on Koha Pack based on HTML, CSS and JS. So you just need to Google uh, because I don't remember the site name. It's Revolution. It's a slider revolution. CSS slide show i think and the very first link amazing css slideshow with examples so there you need to click or you can use this web address it's slider revolution.com backslash resources css dash slideshow okay there you have amazing CSS slideshow with examples and they are really amazing CSS slideshows on and that we can fix on Koha bag or wherever you want to add. <clears throat> it might take few time to load because uh, it's, it's heavy and my internet speed is little down because it's 4 a.m. of Saturday. So you, this is one of the buy, purchase content. So you can have that. And this one is free. So we have HTML, we have CSS and we have JS. So we can use this if you want to. And they all are responsive. This one, this is one of the purchase content. Hmm. Uh. Okay. This one free. This one is purchase content, and then it may it might take time to load actually. So you can have this website. What actually I'm looking for is the 3D slider. So, 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 or I can use control F. This one, okay. Okay, so we can add a 3D slideshow like this on our Koha pack. So we can use uh, some images there. And there we need to check the HTML. And we can copy this HTML.
copy I open my word and another document to open CSS I'm sorry about the internet speed because it's 4 a.m. of Saturday and actually the peak hours of internet use. I just copy this and paste here. Okay, now let's start our work. And there, what we need to do, we need to change the URL of images. We can use till here or if you want to change the complete URL so you can use here. So uh, because we need to change size as well. This is one image, image number two. And image number three. You have to be more patient actually this is something very, um, what I said, I think we need to work carefully, so that's why. Four. My tutorials are normally some long because I go in the details. To explain you each and everything. But we have also started Raflim shorts, so you can have them. Some important shorts available on my channel. Okay. So how many pictures we can add? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Or maybe I, I'm wrong in counting. I think they are eight or they are nine, whatever. So, 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 so. The next thing is about this CSS. <clears throat> and there we need to check what we can remove here. Okay, we will change on Koha pack. So now let me open my... I need to close this. <laughs> okay, so, so let me log in here. And in tools, HTML customization, main user block. So I can add it here because I want to add CSS carousel or the slideshow here so let me copy the source code for safe site and uh,
okay there what i need to do i need to add these links so copy paste save Save. We will change the image uh, images later, but this is just to show you how actually it's work. And here's the CSS. And Control A to select all copy. Now we need to go in Koha administration where we can add CSS. So in global system preferences, we need to find opaque user CSS. And there we can add CSS. And now save. And refresh this. So by default, it will work like this. So now we need to change it and we cannot scroll up and down and block the area. It has background. Okay. So what we can do, we need to change in CSS and we need to change in HTML for images as well. So let's start our working. So now let us adjust the opaque user CSS first and then we will move to HTML customization for images. And here we are at 100%. So you can see this is 100%. Okay, now in opaque user CSS, let me zoom this. There what you need to do first, you need to remove this HTML body because we are not working on HTML body. Uh, on Koha pack, HTML body is actually behind. I mean, this is background screen is called HTML body. And we are working on the main user block. So remove this HTML body. It's actually restrict, it's, it's fix the area. So you cannot move up and down. So now, or we can remove this overflow x to auto and overflow y to auto and we can change this color but the better thing is to remove this html body and save this and let us see Okay, so here we are at 100% and make it 120. So we can see this. Okay, now the height is too big, so we can reduce the height. Uh, width is okay, let it go. We do not need background color, so we can remove background color. And, 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 and. Entire content, so we need small width here. And if we want to make this to uh, 2d 
so we can use we can remove this but the prospect is uh, 1000 px so that's mean it's 3d and the top padding is too much so top padding is actually this area from here to here so we can reduce this to 30 percent and here also slideshow okay margin auto and 170 okay 30 that's fine okay content parasol so with 100 percent and we can also actually uh, reduce the width that's fine doesn't make any difference and it's float right so we can float left as well and it's take 15 seconds hundred percent okay 120 and then and then and this 2px the border and we can change the color for example we need a, a black for example overflow hidden position absolute we can also remove this if we want to um, that's okay let it go so this is actually something trying to make it bootstrap so we can reduce this size as well 80% okay that's it so save now let's see okay this is something good and we can increase the height as well so there not this height content height actually just to try and you can make it more better as per your need and also you can remove this button or this new arrival because it's, it's already there now I think that look good okay after this now let us change the images for that purpose we need to go in koha tools and here in tools uh, html customization so there we can add it this main user block Hmm. what actually we need to add it here we need to add the image of new arrival so we can use this source code or we can use the image directly for example this 
there we have two options link and the image so in image we can insert the image link for example we want to add uh, the catalog it's again and again i'm going to open this <laughs> because we have not catalog any item here okay so advanced search and i have implemented this the very first implementation in Karachi, Pakistan is held by me. <laughs> Anyhow, so acquisition newest to oldest. <clears throat> okay, here we are. So let us select the image, copy image link. And paste here there you can see the size okay too small okay <laughs> anyways let us see what happened I even don't know about this copy image link And if you are going in, okay, there, save. Or you can fix some size, that doesn't matter. Because we have sizing in the uh, CSS as well. Copy image link. And there's no need to fix the size, that's okay. Paste. Let us see with size what happened. But I think let us remove the size. See, look how we have any size, let it go. One, two, three, four. I think we have selected four images. Yeah, four images. Five. Six. And the last one. Another, we have two more, <laughs> okay. The ninth actually, yeah, I remember now.
okay so and similar we can add link like link i start with one link only copy 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 link paste and there for the next copy you just need to change the biblio number and tab here for full record save link paste the same link and change the biblio number if you are going in sequence just change the biblio number full record <laughs> it's not new record and this way you can add the link for all books e okay so you can add the link for further and now uh, let me save so let us see See, we have the new arrival here and there. And uh, yes, you can make it 2D as well. So I'll just show you how. Again, we need to go at CSS. So, and, and, and. Okay, this one, you remove this and save now. See, see. They are 2D now. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I mean, this is your choice, actually. Whatever you want to. And uh, I think this size is to be done. Hmm. okay good so fine thank you very much you are watching rare films we have added one 3d uh carousel uh, or the slideshow on koha main user blog for new arrival